വേറബിൾ കാർഡിയോ വാട്ടർ ഡിഫിബ്രിലേറ്റഡ് ഡബ്ല്യു സി ഡി ഈസ് എ ഡിവൈസ് വിച്ച് ഇസ് വോൺ ഓൺ എ വെസ്റ്റ് മോണിറ്റേഴ്സ് ദ ഹാർട്ട് റിതം കണ്ടിന്യൂസ്ലി ആൻഡ് ഗിവ്സ് എ കൺട്രോൾഡ് എലക്ട്രിക്കൽ ഷോക്ക് ഇൻ കേസ് ഓഫ് ലൈഫ് ത്രെറ്റനിങ് ഹാർട്ട് റിതം ഡിസോർഡേഴ്സ് ഇംപ്ലാന്റബിൾ കാർഡിയോ വാട്ടർ ഡിഫിബ്രിലേറ്റർ ഐ സി ഡി ഈസ് എ സിമിലർ ഡിവൈസ് വിച്ച് ഇസ് ഇംപ്ലാന്റഡ് അണ്ടർ ദ സ്കിൻ ഫോർ ലോങ് ടേം യൂസ് WCD is meant for temporary use for those who have a high risk of life threatening heart rhythm disorders but are ineligible for an ICD WCD has patch electrodes for giving the shocks and a monitoring system built in into a vest while the defibrillator with battery is worn on the belt WCD can also give audible alerts and does not need the help of a bystander as it works automatically a typical wcd device has a maximum shock output of 150 joules and could terminate the most dangerous heart rhythm abnormalities in first attempt with 70 to 100 joules shock still programming at maximum energy output has been suggested for ambulatory patients to ensure good safety margin WCD has been called as a life vest till the life boat arrives meaning that it can be considered during the period when the patient is not eligible for an ICD as per guidelines published by medical societies these include patients within 40 days of a heart attack who are at high risk of life threatening heart rhythm abnormalities but still ineligible for ICD as benefits have not been proven Another possibly more important reason to use WCD is when an ICD has to be explanted due to infection and there is a waiting period before a new one can be implanted. As expected, the most important Achilles heel of a WCD is compliance. Real world studies have shown average daily usage as low as 17.3 hours which means that there would be no protection during the remaining period in a randomized control trial involving 2302 patients of the 48 participants who died only 12 were wearing the device at the time of death another compilation of multiple studies with data on over 32000 patients showed that mortality while wearing wcd is rare 0.7 per 100 persons over 3 months like icds wcd can also give inappropriate shocks sometimes at a rate of 2 per 100 persons over 3 months this is due to errors in judgment by the automatic monitoring software by which non life threatening fast rates are considered as life threatening and shocks delivered errors can be reduced to some extent by meticulous usage technique and programming of the device studies have shown that compliance is more in those who already had a cardiac arrest during previous hospital admission for heart attack as well as in those who had previous heart failure and more wcd alarms poor compliance was noted in those who had any wcd shock when used during the waiting period after icd explantation for a new icd implantation wcd is thought to be a cost effective option usual care typically involves hospital admission for about 21 days while waiting for the new icd implant till the infection in the previous one has cleared with the temporary protection given by wcd if they can go home rather safely and total hospitalization period brought down to about 15 days a cost saving of 1782 euros has been estimated thank you for watching this video please subscribe like share and post your valuable comment below this video